What's up guys, this is Zach out here at TOLA 2023 with Richard from Mad VR, and there is a brand new king of the hill, the Mad VR Extreme Mark II. In just a moment, Richard is gonna give you the lowdown on what's new. Let's go! Yeah, thanks, Zach. We're really excited to tell you about the Envy Mark II. It's been an intensive project we were really excited about. We spent about the last two years engineering everything, prototyping like crazy, all sorts of design, engineering efforts, and the results we think speak for themselves. Uh, we have an all new custom case built from the ground up specifically for what we need, which includes supporting a massive, powerful GPU that generates a lot of heat and making sure that that stays nice and cool in your room or in your rack. So there's a huge push for the aesthetics, build quality on the case, also, the cooling I mentioned features our new Glacier X2 cooling system. So we now have five fans that bring air into the case plus the cooler fans. So that would be six <laughs> fans inside the case. Three of those fans are 140 millimeter fans. Two of them are 120 on the bottom. Okay, so we got about 50% more airflow than the original NV Extreme Mark I. And so that's really important because between that and the GPU coolers, we're able to keep these temperatures really low. So the NV runs super quiet on top of it, right? Because for what you know about airflow, you know, when you use bigger fans, it doesn't mean louder. It's actually the opposite. Bigger fans allow you to move more air with less movement, which results in quietness. So that's really important because we know a lot of people, a lot of our customers use Envy inside their room. They want whisper quiet. You cannot hear the Envy once you get from the distance between you and me. Once you get about two feet, that's it, dead silent. So it's really exciting for there. So we have that. We have all sorts of protection inside the case to make sure your Envy gets to you uh, safely through transit and handling, uh, whether it's one state over or halfway around the world. Uh, there's also all sorts of things for um, the venting, the cooling, the racking. Now it comes with custom rack ears. Uh, the other thing too is we'll soon be shipping our new custom remote control. This is a backlit remote control, very similar to the popular remote control that everyone loves for the Mark I, except they're now laser cut backlit buttons. We give you two more flex buttons for user to find because people were asking for that. But most importantly, people were really asking for backlighting. And we have backlighting with some innovative features, even down to battery saving and how it smartly uses the backlight because everything we think about, we try to be meticulous about. So really the best thing is let's go take a look at the Envy and go through the case and some of the features hands on. All right, I'm excited. Let's go check it out, guys. So here it is, the Envy Extreme Mark II. I want to point out a couple different things. This is a 20 millimeter all aluminum faceplate with our company slogan, every pixel counts, beautifully laser engraved. The Envy laser engraved as well. Just even to get it and just to touch it feels so smooth. Feel this, Zach. Rub your hand across Ooh, this. Feel yeah. that. No, rub your hand across <laughs> that logo, baby. Isn't that nice? Beautiful. Okay, so then you have here, you got your uh, power light and your power button. And there's a little toggle switch under here you can use to turn the button, to turn the power light on and off if you prefer to have it off, okay? Now, as you see, the feet here are removable also for custom racking. Just simply counterclockwise, hand turn, all four feet, put them safely in the box in case you need them for later. Custom rack ears mount right along the side here. So you simply take out these four screws. The custom rack ears come in the case, in the accessory box. Go ahead, pull out these screws, put the ear on, put those four screws back in, and you have the beautiful rack ears uh, ready to go and put this whole thing. This is four rack units down from five from the Mark I. So it was really important. So we have the GPU managed to fit a larger GPU in a smaller profile case since it was custom built by us. Okay, taking a look here at the cooling, you can see here these are 340 millimeter uh, static pressure fans that are designed to bring in the strong amount of airflow through the filters to help protect it from dust. You also have two underneath, okay, these bring more cool air here. You have another vent, another fan on this side as well, and then you have all the venting from the top. 
okay, where the temperatures run nice and cool. Ryan, look at this. Look at these temperatures. Okay, if you guys are familiar with anything related to GPUs, high-end GPUs, you'll know these are extremely low temperatures, and that's the Glacier X2 cooling system doing its job. Okay, now let's go ahead and flip around to the back. I'll go ahead and show you some things on the back. I just want to give you guys an idea of how much detail went into every aspect of this design. Okay, so normally you would find a power supply on this side. We actually put the power supply on the opposite side because it allowed us through our testing to get more power, more cooling. This way the cooling comes in on the right side through these 140 millifans, blows right onto the HDMI card and the GPU, part of our secret keeping everything so cool. Versus normally, if the intake fans are on the left, it would be blowing the air right onto the back plate of the GPU which doesn't really help it cool anything. Okay, you, got the, you can see through here, you've got the cooler down here. It's also doing its job to keep the motherboard nice and cool and these, these venting. So it's very open yet safe. And you've got this custom attention to detail on the back. It's actually one of my favorite views of the Envy. It looks like we still have the protective film on it. So go ahead and pull that off. Okay, so now you got an even better view. Custom I.O. socket. This is also really, uh, really important if you're familiar at all with these types of systems. Um, this is a really nice, super clean look. You've got um, the product labeled. This is for your IR and RF dongle over here. And then this is for your LAN port. And then there's two spare ports here for whatever you may need. For if you need some USB power, for let's say to power an active fiber cable, or if you want to plug in a keyboard to control, like it's good for like renaming profiles, doing those types of things, that's always easy to do. And here's your GPU, as we talked about before, a double the amount of power uh, between the Mark II and the Mark I, and then your HDMI card with your zero latency pass-through and your HDMI input. Big thanks for coming on our channel today, Richard. We could not be more excited about Mad VR. This is the industry's best of the best video processor, and we have it integrated into many of our customers' homes, and I can't wait to continue to implement these into systems. If you are interested in learning more about Mad VR, call and schedule a free video consultation with one of my specialists. We love this stuff, guys, and we would love to go through all the different features and benefits to using a Mad VR, as well as any other home theater equipment that you may be interested in purchasing. Keep in mind, we do offer our Dream Media Plus program nationwide and would love the opportunity to earn your business. If you like this video, give me a big thumbs up and make sure to smash that subscribe button down below for more. Till next time, this is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater out here with Richard from Mad VR. Thanks for watching.